hello again as you can see things are looking a little different and not until I'm looking at it again I guess I have a theme I somehow made everyone <laughs> pink pink and purple oh well it's all good so yeah I got a little tired of the turtles it's a funny thing but uh, four monks uh, I don't know either it's an OCD thing or I'm just saying, you know what, I do not feel like putting up with these four turtles any longer than I have to. So I started over and I was messing around trying to figure out different classes. And I did something pretty neat. And so I started over, started recording, and I wrote down a list. And what we're going to do is I'm going to show you some steps of what I did. So whenever we exit the Nautiloid, you're level 2. And might just try and mess around and see how we can figure out how to really uh, exploit the experience system and there is a way to do it it's, I know with one fight that in the chapel where you can kind of double dip but I'll explain that later for now Let's have a look oh I should probably introduce the team Dead. first off we have the great lizardini he's a warlock and I'm trying something new. My boy Lizardini, he's going to be doing a little bit of Eldritch Blast. We could try Sleep. And I don't see a save. It just creatures that have up, put creatures into a magical slumber. Select targets up to a combined 24 hit points. That seems like that would be very effective. Fairy Fire. Apparently you light people up. And then when they're in that circle, they gain advantage. Which I think would be ridiculous for like the rogue for sneak attacks and stuff so we'll see how that works we have crushinator a tiefling barbarian it's kind of funny her job is just smacking things and also i didn't realize there's a special thing we can do with barbarians here in the nautiloid which was kind of funny now we have sir grug the half orc cleric and this guy this beautiful man he is gonna do so everyone everyone has a role in this party and playing with the cleric i'm like i don't know how i feel about cleric it's all right blah 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 do you see this right here command holy smokes command is good command is really good and i'll show you why and you got little sneaks the deep gnome uh i don't know i needed a rogue someone pure rogue this I haven't tried, like, thieving yet, pickpocketing, because I haven't really found any any merchants yet. So if it's anything like, I keep going back, if it's anything like Divinity, so we'll see what happens. But I have advantage on some saving throws, automatically attack an enemy moving out of your, uh, yeah, that's advantage on stealth checks. You know, so we'll say, ah, eh, might be a little, a little helpful with the sneaking department. So that's what we have. So let's just start going. Let's see. First on my list, we need to go meet. Why am I little sneaks? I picked the great lizardini to lead the way. Because he has the highest... Oh, it was there. Charisma. So just in case I bump into someone, I don't know if that's how it works. For persuasion and stuff. Goblins, we'll read some books. I think I saw something pop up like how many books you've read. I don't know if it was an achievement or not. I don't remember. But I'm, I'm going to read books anyway. And I don't even know if those count as books. Alright. We're going to kind of just run through a little bit of this. But here's our friend. Oh, so this person's Myrneth. Last time I played, I failed a check. And the Intellect Devourer ran and jumped off, and then it said that Myrneth died from a, like, a fall. I don't know, that's weird. Yeah, yeah, we hear ya. I'm skipping. We got a brain. This brain really needs our help to get out. So, first step, we need to... Uh, uh, who am I talking to, a man or a brain? Realize you're talking to an intellect devourer, a minion of the mind flayers who abducted you. 
I think you're past the point of saving. Move us from this body. From this case. Free us. Please. Okay. Uh, we just have to pass these checks. And then we just spare the brain after. So let's see. <laughs> let's see if we do that. Oh, yeah. Let's get this brain out of there. Ended up looking up, so these are people abducted and they were thralled. You could cripple this, and they did unholy mind flare rituals to turn their brain into a little creature. Yeah, I'm not mutilating the brain, we're just gonna spare it for reasons you'll see later. If you accidentally fail your, I guess you could if you wanted to, but if you failed the check to uh, mutilate the brain to lobotomize it. It gets hostile and runs away. And I don't know what happens after that, but I like having it by my side for a second. Like, you'll, you'll, you'll see why. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, let's go. And the brain can help us in this next fight. Alright, saving the brain. 20 experience. Next on our list, we need to meet... We need to meet our little Githyanki friend. What's her name? Lezel? Lezel? I should have wrote it down, but I didn't. She's right here. She's right here. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We see you. Seen this all before. Don't care. What do you suggest? Kill the imps. Oh, I like the way her hair just kind of like... Wigged out for a second. No. Alright, these are four imps. It'll be easy enough to put these guys down. One health left. Alright. Sometimes the only way out is through. That's true. Some Um Can you reach now after jumping? No. That's <sighs> We're off to a good start. Anything we can throw? A bottle. Whatever. No choice but to keep going. Alright, great Lizardini. Hit him with that Eldritch Blast. Survival is all that matters. Yeah, I I, I guess you're in the way. Can you like Oh, cancel in turn. Can you just scoot around like this? As long as you don't leave, there's no attack of opportunity. So that's cool. That works. Now stop. Everything, despite everything. Hey! That's how you do it. Check this out. This jump. Look at this. Um, <laughs> boing. She really knows how to jump, doesn't she? You can't hit him with a little sacred flame, Sir Grug. Sure be nice of you. Nope. One damage. Yeah, just just get as close as you can. I don't care. Oh uh, look, <laughs> this would be faster. Hello, Eldritch Blast. It's too good. Too good. All right, we should be at sixty. There you have it. Now, keeping track of your experience might get a little tricky because I did earn experience just on one character when I was playing around with those good old Ninja Turtles. So there's like, it was background specific things you can get experience on. So yeah, then so keep a track of how much total experience you have. It, it's kind of like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's not going to be completely accurate, but it's at least a good baseline. And I did want to replay this because I don't know if I just had really, really good luck earlier and like the, the helm battle or if this is just a good team or what. But we'll figure it out. Let's get everyone... Oh, nope. Party view. You, you can always Eldritch Blast. You don't need ranged. We throw a range on these people. Give you a short, so short sword. 
Because you're a little rogue, you're having fun. And give these hand axes to the barbarian to throw. If the need, and just throw everything if the need arises. Okay, we have three special sigils and three buttons. I don't remember what it was. Uh, it was like unleash, and then nothing happens. Aggression makes you fight them, and this one kills them. Killing them gives you no experience, and nobody likes that. We're gonna ungroup. Have some people kind of just hang out here. What is that noise? It is a dog at my feet. You can be a little sneaky. And press the middle button. Machine made them hostile. The she's not even in combat. A little sneak attack won't hurt anyone. And then you know what's crazy? With dual wield, you can do a like ranged, then just come over here and do a little offhand. Is look look at that. That's insane. At least things. All right, sorry about that. Um, I looked down at my feet and my dog brought three different toys. So I had to play and throw a little bit. So right now, we just got another 20 experience, putting us up at 80. So the Mind Flare pod. What I learned during the Ninja Turtle playthrough is you run <laughs> the Ninja Turtle playthrough, which I didn't get very far. You run in here, you get like a the sphincter. You get a key, you come, well, what was it, like a... A rune and you put it in here and you open it up but check this out your barbarian just tries to grip it and rip it but it's too tight or is it <laughs> so you just like it's supposed to be alien technology they had like magic awards and junk on it and the barbarians just like grip it and rip it so saving shadow heart which i thought she was like a ninja or a rogue she's a cleric so huh i i guess that's what i get for assuming her class I'm getting out of here. Follow me if you can Trust keep up. Me. I'll keep up. All right then, let's get going. I'm the Great Lizardini. Wait, I think I'll take my time. Yeah, because I have a full party. Yeah, I don't know what that does yet, but I'm sure it's some kind of like crazy thing. There we go. Oh look, uh, you can also keep track of experience here. Another five experience. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right. Swift as my feet can carry. We have to do a little fight. Better not be cursed. There's another intellect of our running around. There it is. So here's what you do. You see good old the one following us? If we attack this one, us says, Hey, you're not a thrall and starts fighting uh the party. Still breaking, so despite everything. Not ranged attack. <laughs> So all we have to do, that was 10, don't kill it. Missed, don't kill it. You killed it. Alright, uh, reload. Hey, let's try again! Um, no time to rest. someone who's maybe not as, like, crazy strong. Five. You just, you just want to weaken it. You don't want to kill it. That was a crit. Okay, let's leave it at that to be safe. Is that blood? No. So now, never mind. Let's get a little bit of this going on. What? What? Don't judge me. Oh, you know what? We look, look, look. How about a, how about we do something else? I just realized my big mistake. On keyboard, you hit shift and space, and now we're in turn-based mode. Uh, yeah, we've, I could have done that earlier. 
That's a little bit smarter, isn't it? Oh, and us doesn't get an attack. Whoa, really? Usually you do that and just like, you're not one of us and attacks. Huh. Well, isn't that nice? Still on my feet. And it missed. Why do I have Eldritch Blast? Usually if you start an attack, is it because I started in turn-based mode? I'm not sure. Now I have disadvantage because we're so close. Eh, we'll smack it. There we go. Ten experience for each of them. That brings us up to 105. We're, we're close. But you're, we're, we're, we're about to jump up a lot real quick. I don't know if really there's anything to do in here. I don't, you can press that button and she turns into a mind flare. Anything of use? And you said, wait a second. Those tadpoles behind that they inserted behind our eyeballs will turn us into a, a mind flare. And are mind flares aberrations? What are they? I don't know. By turning into some crazy monster, I don't like it. I I never looted. I I never, I never looted you. There's a key on this body. Grab the key, put the key in the chest, and earn untold riches. I even wrote it down. Grab the gold key off the dead thrall. Use the gold key to open the elaborate reliquary. Oh, that is that is what it's called. Or I'll grab a necklace. A dark mind. Yeah, we'll grab a brain. A brain and a jar. No one warrior. needs to be healed. If you need and to be healed, you can use these restoration pods. And after a couple of seconds, they do like recharge. So here's here's the big scary helm. Let's see if the same thing happened last time. I was here. And no, it didn't. When I was playing earlier, I could see the outline of Shadow Heart like here. I was thinking, where are you? What, what happened? But she's not here now. Weird. Do a quick little save. So messing around with things real quick. If you're one of the, if you want to just play for real, what happens happens. You know, just have fun. If ugh. feels like we're about to go fight Gygus, doesn't it? But if you save and reload, like, it's a random dice roll every time. So you could, like, well, I really want to pass this. Or what happens if I fail this? You can kind of, you know, mess around. Man, I don't want to be too cheaty. We're, we're just going to have fun. Down he goes. Yeah, we'll get to it. Okay, so let's explain what I'm what I'm, <laughs> I'm about to do. You got some guys to fight. What you're supposed to do is in 15 turns, you come over here and activate the helm, yeah, the transponder, whatever this guy's saying. What now, first off, take care of these these guys. I'm about to say should be easy enough. But you know, stuff happens. It's alright if you just take a little bit of time. Not. No. Just come up and smack. Don't walk through that. Cleric, how about you uh, step up to the task first? Four. That's it. Time for some bloody work. So that's close enough. It could have been. It could have been a lot better. Yeah, I want to shove you. Get out of here. Oh, look. I can still do an offhand. Can I get close enough? Please. Time to press ahead. I can't get there. Really? You're not... Oh. You're going to let me... I can. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. See, so there's some, there's some stuff that you kind of need to sneak by a little bit, have a little fun. Let's see if I can tempt that boar. An 
Mother you, finds. I'm gonna cancel Let's your go. intern. You need to move. One day I'll catch a break. So you want to just take out these people, hopefully a little bit cleaner than this, and slowly move forward. Mind Flayer will only attack Commander Zalk. Commander Zalk will only attack the Mind Flayer. For now, at least. Good job, buddy. There, one problem's done. We're just gonna get everyone to move a little bit closer. And while we're here, uh, all targets turn visible and attack rolls have advantage. I might, I might pop them with that. Oh, I guess it could have raged. Whatever, we can do it now. So I'm Still just getting these people in position. What path lies before? <coughs> and Nothing important is ever easy. <coughs> what are these dogs doing? There is there's nothing else you can do. You can end your turn. This is worth the cost. Please ignore the dogs. They're nuts. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to cast fairy fire. All targets within the light turn visible, which we don't care about, but attack rolls against them have advantage. I'm going to make sure and these guys are just constantly going to have... They both saved. I don't know. I I think it didn't do anything right. Whatever. Uh, I tried. <laughs> I tried. I just don't want to hit my own people with it. Because... Commander Zalk is way too strong. So we're going to command him to drop his weapon. Only a 55% chance. And he did it. I've never had this fail yet. It could just be luck. But look, uh, he just doesn't have a weapon. And you can grab it. I won't give in. And she's just going to finish her dash. One day, I'll catch a break. Not enough movement. Oh, whatever. Swift as my feet can carry me. Yoink! Get behind him. Um, should I take an? A I think I will take an action now, just to equip the sword. I didn't do this last time, but we'll see if this helps. Just to make this fight a little, hopefully, go a little bit faster, at the cost of not doing an attack now. The same thing, we piercing strike. No, that's not gonna work. It needs to be ranged. Let's just do a ranged attack. No one has advantage on them, so that stinks. But uh, we tried. I guess they both did a saving through for fairy fire. Wait, where are you going? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Never mind. I was trying, like, why am I doing this? You need to take one guy, get a, bit, a little bit closer to the transponder, more enemies will spawn. You can take them out and then just worry about the commander. So we just did a hell of a lot of a hell of a lot with this command. Let's finish it with guiding bolt. It's only 40. Let's see what happens. Miss. Oh well, we tried. Does my feet can carry me? There's gonna be a lot of missing. But the mind flare is going to do the major homeboy. Oh Unless he's going to do the majority of the damage. The this could really dead. just be luck. But you want to kill this guy. No, let let's get these people to pop up. Yeah, yeah, to connect. I I get you. Not too worried about Come them. On. Can't stay idle. Keep trying to bring this guy down as fast as we can. Days cleave. Don't I have prepare? I guess I don't. We're gonna rage. I didn't even consider raging. We're raging. Can we hopefully make this guy bleed a bit? Nope. S 
stunned. That's nice. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Nothing will stand in my way. Done. Eleven turns. We could be doing better. No choice but to keep going. Man, we are missing so much. It stinks. Is it better to attack? Hey, that was a crit. Oh, melee automatically does an offhand. Okay, I gotcha. I wonder if this is worth the cost. Take care of some of this. Help them out. Let's go. Oh man, that stinks so much. You might have noticed on round 10, a couple of friends pop up. So that's kind of why you want to rush. Yeah, here they are. Come a little Wow, you really, you really got hurt, didn't you, buddy? And a miss? Oh, I I'm gonna. Luck again. Is there an attack of opportunity? No. I'm gonna have to save this guy. I can't put anyone to sleep. Nearby foes. Do I want to do this? A wisdom check. That's a whole action. I don't want to do that just in case. Man, these people are unkillable. I am not not having a good time. We we really are missing a lot. Okay, we might still be able to do this. We could pull this off. One health left. So much for peace. Let's just see. Can you? If I move here and use cleave. Damn it. Survival is all that matters. <laughs> Damn it. No choice but to keep going. Nothing will stand in my way. That is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Well, you get an achievement if you get the last hit on the guy, which we didn't do. But we did get 75 experience for killing him. Now here's where the fun begins. Please, please target. Yes. If they kill the Mind Flayer, that's an additional 75 experience. Which is absolutely what you want to do. Oh, attack of opportunity. So, if you dash, you can reach that. I'm not worried about it. We still have an Imp to take care of, don't we? Yeah, we do. Cool, cool. Just get a little bit closer. Blood comes easy these days. You, you please let me hit this guy. Thank you. Breathe deep and move. Can't even catch my breath. Oh. What if, oh man, I might have to disengage and run away. Can't slow down. 
I should have disengaged with the rogue. Let's see what happens. Fight. Let's go. They're gonna make short work. Uh oh. Will she still be alive if we just so much for peace. cheese it and get here? Never a dull moment. Let's find out. Nothing important is ever easy. Done. Got him. There we go. Level two. Let's get the hell out of here. So see, even with a lot of misses and bad rolls, we can still just barely escape. Hello. She's better. I also could have looted Commander Zulk, and I think it's just like a scale mail on him. So that's not that big of a deal, but having that sword early is really nice. Watch in amazement as I press the number one on each character as fast as I can. As you watch it. As you watch it. So, so, so there we go. She, she was like. All right, death saving throw. You need to heal her. Ah, she's fine. Here you go. Level two. As well, like right before leaving the Nautiloid, actually, as soon as we killed that mind flare. So that's really, really nice. Let's level these fools up. Oh, and then like landing at the beach, you get another five experience for ex exploration. All right, my warlock. Oh, buddy. There are a lot of things we can do. We need a new spell. I really like Hex. It only makes our attacks deal an additional 1 to 6 necrotic damage. But we can give them dis disadvantage on ability checks of our choosing. So, you can say, like, you will always fail with... Not fail. You will have disadvantage on wisdom. You will have disadvantage on dexterity. Stuff like that. But then if we if the dies the target dies before the spell ends, I can cast Hex again without expending a spell slot. Which is I think's pretty nice. So we'll go with that. Eldritch invocations. There's all sorts of crazy things you can do. But what we're gonna do is add our charisma modifier to Eldritch Blast, which is plus three. And then also make it so Eldritch Blast can push a creature up to 15 feet away from us. So if there's someone on the edge of a cliff, just like, hey, see ya, buddy. And there's no spells I want to replace. So we are good to go. Barbarian level up. I'm... Let's see, what do you get? Danger Sense. And then Reckless Attack. Until your next turn, you have advantage on attack rolls, but enemies also have advantage against you. I'm debating, you know what, being Barbarian level 2, but if I'm multi-class into Fighter, you only have 24 HP, and I get a bonus action to just heal myself, just in case things get a little dire. I, I kind of feel like I want to do that, just for a little bit more survivability. Not, not that bad, I don't think. So we'll see what happens. Oh wait, fighting, that's right, fighting style. Great weapon fighting. If you roll a 1 or 2 on a damage die for an attack with a two-handed melee weapon, it's rerolled once. Which I think is worth it, because we'll only be using two-handed great weapons. I think that's a good give or take. Alright, Sir Grug. A beautiful man. We are able to get a pretty good weapon because of you. And it also removed a lot of Commander Zalk's damage to uh, spare the Mind Flayer, because if you killed him while the Mind Flayer was still nice to us, I uh, had that green outline, we wouldn't get experience. So even though the Mind Flayer or like those other Cambian demon guys killed them, we still would have gotten experience because he was hostile to us. That's at least how the engine works. But we can learn, we have another spell slot and then a Divinity Charge. So we can either turn undead or Knowledge of the Ages. Gain proficiency in all skills of a chosen ability until a long rest. That's, I think that's really good. Just, as soon as you can, pick something like, yeah, I'm going to be passing all of these. 
Well, not passing. I have advantage on all of these checks. I think that's great. Do I need to change any of this? Yeah, I... Uh, I'll heal a little less, but at a distance. Guiding Bolt didn't do that. <laughs> it didn't help that much, but... Some creator Destroy Water could be funny. Bless up to three creatures. Yeah, you can either bless three creatures or, like, curse them. And I feel like it'd be better to bless on our party members. Because if, like, you use this... And do three creatures that you're fighting. If you're fighting five and kill them really fast, then it's like, okay. But if at least you bless your party members, those ten turns of attack, uh, 1d4 bonus attack rolls and saving throws, it'll last longer. That's, um, that's my thoughts on the matter. Wait. Increase armor class by two until long rest. But you need concentration. I'm not entirely sure how concentration works. You can only cast one concentration spell at a time. And it might be broken when they take damage. Yeah, that's kind of weird, isn't it? Let's just do some. If someone gets too close, and we really need to do a lot of damage, we can... I guess I could have tried to do that. <laughs> oh, and the helm. Oh, well. All good. And now you. Rogue is... Look at this, just as a bonus action, you can hide, dash, or disengage. Yeah, I'm staying with that. <laughs> Everyone's so pink. I really did not mean to do that. Uh, oh, well, that's funny. I'm rolling with it. So after leveling everyone up, look. We're like, what, a fourth? A little more, a little less than a third of the way until level three? 161 experience. What do I have next on my list? Breathe deep. Our good friend Shadowheart. Invite her to the camp. Hello. The artifact. She don't know what it does. Let's wake her up. We're gonna be nice. We're not gonna try and like, oh hi, cool thing in your hands. Mind if I grab it? You're alive. Yep. I'm Alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do? How is this, how possible? Is this possible? It doesn't matter. We made True. it. Seems like we're the. I. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Now uh, what? We might have yeah, we. You want to come with me? We need each other. We All right, let's get moving. With I'll mark my head. camp on your map. You can Fine. rest there. There she goes. Off to the camp. And we received a cool 30 experience. Wait, was that something we missed? No, no, just a dead body. We'll pick up some stuff along the way. Is this hat always here? It's mine now. That hat might always be there. And then let's check out some buckets of fish. Get, huh. It's extra food for the camp. A fish head, yep. Commonly used in stocks or grilled for the succulent bits of cheek. Throat and eyes? I wouldn't... Mm, fresh water. I wouldn't re nearby. read. Read! I wouldn't eat the eyes. We'll take this person's love letter. You said... <laughs> Was it just me or did you hear a faint toot of a horn? Let's do it. Let's meet at Baldur's Gate. Go to the boat and don't be dead. Oops. If you are dead, then surely I will dread. We just run around looting all this cool stuff. Are these? Oh, the dead fish. These are all fishermen that just died while you know doing their job, which is not ideal. It's like an. Oh, are these like a bunch of people that uh? We're captive on the Nautiloid. You know, thrown about. Nope. Curse to put my hands on everything. Yeah, that's the waypoint. We need that. Um. Yes. Please. Can little sneaks it. open this? Oh, difficulty class twenty. We do have a plus seven. Nope. 
close, but it didn't work. Yeah, I'm not gonna waste my last thieves tool. We missed all these flowers. What do I have? What do I have? There are three intellect devourers over there. We're gonna circle back around, make sure we grab and loot everything that we see. There's the intellect of ours. You can say, oh no, people, More run away. And then, hostile. That's why I like highlights. It's easy to pick out where your people are and whether or not they would just immediately attack you. So here's what we're going to do. Everyone, hide. Then we're going to split up. Rogue, you're gonna be shooting from on high, won't you? So you get here. Kind of the same with you. Kind of the same with you. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! That's right, people. Uh, Walker, yikes! Oh, uh, I know what we can do here. All right, little sneaks. Turn-based mode. You know, look, we have advantage because we're hiding, and then disadvantage because they're outside of our range, so they cancel each other out. Better stay back. And they're all surprised. So, okay, look. She is the only one in combat. Which is exactly what we need. I'll never see this giant sword. So we would just do a quick little sneak attack. She joined the battle. And now Sir Grug. Oh look, now it's your turn. Oh well. I wonder your turn. Look, that was her turn. Ha ha. Let's time to take our turn. Look at that. That's that's how you get into a scrap. You never want to just rush in head first on equal playing ground, playing field. You know, it, you want to be as as tricky as sneaky as possible. This game will not hold back. I guess I should also say I am playing on balanced right now. Only because I just want to, you know, we're kind of having fun. I want to explore, learn classes, learn the ropes, a silver locket. Oh, lemon! That lemon will make a fine lemon stew. But uh, it's just learning the game. After, I'm going to play on tactician. But it's, I'm just having fun. Oh, something else we can do first. So, those three intellect of ours, 10 experience each. So we're up another 30, and then we have this Mind Flayer over here. There he is. Oh, crud, he fell. Oh, he slipped when he saw us. Look! Yeah, so you should not even try and talk to it. It's stupid, you get nothing for talking to it. Who cares? Kill it. Put it out of its misery for a cool 35 experience. Look at this. A whopping 256 experience. So now I think we can meet our good buddy Asterion. And we need to invite this lovely chap into the party. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Um, say easily. Stand back. There. Can you see it? This uncle just turn around and just sound. bite this guy's face. Not if you want to keep that darling neck of yours. Now, I saw you on the ship. Yeah. Hey, look. Didn't I? Red eyes, he got fangs, he has a bite on his neck. This guy's a vampire. Have I played enough Dwarf Fortress to know, number one, don't trust an elf. Number two, 
white hair, pale skin, red eyes, fangs, two bite marks on his neck. I'm gonna headbutt the elf. Get this guy. 14. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> what happens? What will happen? If you wriggling little. Your mind twists. Oh. Not a bad deal, I guess. Eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. What was that? What's going on? Whisper a cantrip to burn his hand. I just say it's the Mind Flayer's worm, it connected us. There you go. You're you're not as much as a jerk as you look. They took you. Just the same as me. Yeah, and then you tried to slash my neck. I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. No apologies. Apology not accepted. Glad to see we're all caught up now. Indeed we are. Please. My well, that was different. Astaria. At least for me. Yeah, it's so I... Certain. Me too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did Unfortunately... You know about these words? I know. I said that last time. He goes, Ha ha, of course they'll turn me into a monster. Say, I know we don't want them in our heads. No. Of that much we can be certain. These... Worms are already affecting me. I can feel it. Now, what to do about it? I need to get moving, but you can shelter at my camp. I was ready to go this alone. Yeah, the but pale elf. He's a vampire. A it's idea. obvious. Look at this. I kind of... I don't know if I can leave, like, a custom character... In the camp right. and take him because I kind of want to know this I'll guy's story you. now. <laughs> For a second, it looked like his animation, he was going to skip away. <laughs>